Book Readings with Miss Bernard. Hello everyone and welcome to another Book Readings with Miss Bernard. Today is day 8 of our Black History Month series. Today's story is entitled, Why? A Conversation About Race. Written by Tay Diggs and illustrated by Shane W. Evans. These are the creators of some of my favorite stories, such as Chocolate Me, Mixed Me, My Friend, and I Love You More Than. It's always great when an author and an illustrator team up for an entire series of great works. Okay, let's begin our story. A Conversation About Race. Why are those buildings burning? Daddy? Yes, my sweet boy. Why are those people shouting? Our people are shouting because we need to be heard. We need to be heard. Oh. Mama? Yes, baby girl. Why are those people crying? Our people are crying because we are in pain. We are in pain. Oh. Nana. Yes, my grandson. Why are those people pointing? Our people are pointing because we need help. We really need help. Oh. Granddad. Yes, my lovely granddaughter. Why are those people marching? Our people are marching because we have been stomped on and stepped over for way too long. Way, way too long. Oh. The little children looked at the brown skin, staring back in their reflections. He saw the bright light of fire through the window. She could smell the dark smoke. Family? Yes? Why are those buildings burning? Because, little one, when we get tired of shouting and not being heard, when we have cried so many tears from always getting hurt, when we scream out for help and continue to get ignored, when we march and march and march but are not really moving, when all this happens, Sometimes buildings must burn. The buildings burn for us. The anger burning those buildings is us. The child then sat down and crossed her legs. He closed his eyes. Why are you praying, little one? They all asked. I'm praying for faith and love. If we have that, then maybe we can figure this all out. Maybe then we will have peace. Yes, I believe we will figure this out. So they all sat down and closed their eyes and prayed. They all prayed for peace. Oh. The end. Hmm. What a chilling reality of the injustice in this world today. Through the eyes and the innocent questioning of children. You know, children will always ask why. Always. And it's up to the adults in their life to respond and to continue to educate them with the truth about what's really going on in their world. 
All right, this has been another book reading with Miss Bernard. Remember to like and subscribe and hit the bell to be notified when I post new stories. And also remember to come back tomorrow for day nine of our Black History Month series. Okay, I hope you have an amazing day. Bye-bye.